Hello folks, uh, it's, a, it's a key idea how to define the valid breakout out of the Asian range and how to define the valid reversal from it. So many people are asking this question very frequently and it looks like that this question is an actual key to the holy grail of trading the Asian range. So I have a decent amount of uh, trades to recap with you for this video and let's start. As you always know, uh, today is 11th April when I'm recording this video. We did have this decent 25-hour uh, trade. This is just very simple. Uh, this is a third method of overpowered investing. As you know, the Euro USD. we did have this um, <clears throat> false breakout over here. And after that, the price started reversing on the one-minute time frame. This is very, very clear and very, very trivial, guys. The price made the sweep to the downside it made a break of structure to the upside nothing is um nothing ambiguous or uh, anything like the price break to the upside came down retested this auto block over here and then uh it's just flew to the upside the place for uh for the aims what this uh untested auto block over here on the left as you can see this is very beautiful it has some imbalance it has um this uh strong auto block over here and here is the result the price went tested the 50 percent of it of course we could have have uh, this trade as well over here but yeah it, it depends it depends guys uh, actually, let's uh, move to our uh, main topic, how to define the correct breakout and correct reversal when it comes to the breakout, because there are some other factors as well. <clears throat> so here I have a little note, how to identify the reversal or a continuation. If price breaks out, then reverses and with one impulse comes to the to the any point of interest break a block or auto block then respects it then is considered to be a valid breakout like um like here guys uh here just don't pay attention for all of these trades of course i can kind of like uh cover them as well maybe i will try to cover them here here is uh here is our point as you can see the price break uh price break to the downside very strongly after which with one strong like impulse it came to the upside to mitigate this uh, order block because as you can see this break block is a weak break block actually so it went up and then straight forward it just reversed to the downside after which we do have this breakout to the upside this is v-shaped formation the price came down to retest this imbalance over here after which we do have this break of structure to the downside over here if we delete this guys uh over here we do have this uh, break of structure after which the price uh, went up tested this break block over here 50 percent perfectly and then just plunge it to the downside okay let's move to the next day as you can see this is another uh, good example of the respected breaker block the price just broke to the upside here we have our strong breaker block the price came down retested it went to the upside to retest this order block over here but over here we do have a very strange situation the price broke to the downside very very impulsively very very strongly but after that the price uh, started coming up again to retest the something like break a block maybe or the auto block over here and as you can see here the price is not moving to the upside with one with one strong impulse as it was here like uh as it was here like two candles it went to the point of interest over here like uh four candles it went to the point of interest very straightforward very clear and easy here we do have a very multiple like one two three four five six six candles to go to the upside and after that the price the price broke broke this uh previous order block the first order block with its weak 
and it can be concluded that we do have this v-shaped formation the price came down retested the 50 percent of this break of lock over here and then flew to the upside this is a gist of this video actually guys so let's move to the other video <clears throat> Again, guys, uh, you should be very, very, um, very, very um, sensitive to such kind of like changes. The price broke to the downside, made a uh, made a pull back, made another uh, pull to the downside over here. You see this candle uh, low, uh, this candle weak out uh, out shoots uh, the previous candles uh, low. So this is kind of like next impulse. And the next impulse to the upside broke this week to the upside, kind of like making, creating a break of structure. And here we do not have, after for example, uh, testing this with this week, this auto block over here, we didn't just fell to the downside. The price just made indecision candle, another indecision, and then we started moving slowly and gradually to the upside, after which we broke this leg to the upside. So we can conclude that the price started reversing and then we just get this impulse to the upside and <clears throat> we took a trade on the 786 level uh, 786 level which is perfectly matched over here and we um, aim at those highs guys those are the very beautiful trades we do have a break of structure the price goes respect this order block another break of structure the price went respects this uh, white auto block over here um so yeah just simple so uh guys i hope you understood uh, uh here we do have a clear and very straightforward example the price just broke to the upside uh, to the downside went to the upside tested out the break block and just straightforward after that it started reversing and it's just plunged to the downside guys so very important very easy guys so uh, be careful when we do have this when we do have this range if after the breakout we do have a clear move to the break block or the block or something else we most of the times is uh, in respect of them we most of the times are going to see the clear next move to the upside for example in this case of the breakout to the upside but if we come to our point of interest very slowly indeci indecisively and gradually and we sweep previous low by week by candle doesn't matter guys if we does not respect most of the uh, most of the times this is considered considered to be a v-shaped formation a reversal and the price just goes up test something and then continues to the opposite side uh so <clears throat> to uh, I, I i i don't i don't say that you have to blindly follow me this is just a free knowledge for you this is my observations guys so please go and test it out yourself test it yourself guys i really really uh call all of you to test all of the concepts that i'm teaching you here by yourself uh for those who watch till this moment i really love and appreciate you thank you so much and i wish you all the best if you like this video please subscribe if you're not subscribed hit the like button and share with your friends peace bye bye